New at noon, Capital Metro plans to vote on whether to ban smoking at their bus stops. That vote is set for this afternoon. The thing is, even if it passes, Cap Metro cannot enforce the ban. Our Kate Whitehall is live in Austin to explain. Hi, Kate. Hey, good afternoon. Well, Capital Metro actually wants to put up signs at 2,700 bus stops, just like this one off North Lamar Boulevard, that state there is no smoking or tobacco use within 15 feet of the bus stop, meaning this guy right here, well, they wouldn't want him smoking, right, Sandy there? They would use a $250,000 grant that expires in February to pay for the signs, poles, and workers to put it all up. The thing is, even if the Capital Metro Board approves this policy change today, well, they do not have any the authority to enforce it since it's off of their property. So in the end, this would all be voluntary. The board has already approved a measure that prohibits smoking on metro rail platforms and limits where you can smoke at park and ride locations, and those can be enforced since it's on capital metro property. Now, if the board passes the smoking ban today, it would go into effect in March, and of course, we'll keep you posted on what happens. Live in Austin, Kate Whitehall, KXC.